another one uh, let me just show you guys what I'm gonna do for when I do a bet sky swap I want to choose only certain skies so say for example I only want the sky that one that 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 maybe that one as well okay so I'm going to copy those guys to a new folder that I made in my documents I made a folder auto sky swap so I'm just gonna paste those guys in there go to chaotic settings and then I wanna set a new sky path so go to sky a custom sky textures path and click on browse path and then in my documents um, documents and then auto sky swap okay so that's now my new folder for my skies and then batch auto quick swap and where's that folder sky swap batch and then that folder there <coughs> Okay, so let me have a look see where is that folder. Desktop and then sky swap batch JSON. Okay, so here are my sky images being generated. You got the same sky twice, it's fine. I'll just change it. Uh, is it done? Not yet. it's done now okay so I need to now just fix up some of not done yet or is it done what did I do now um, blue sky photo where's that folder there was it done I think it was done anyway Okay, so I need to just fix up these guys here. So, using a black brush, I'm gonna just clean up some of these images. So, you just basically take your black brush and then clean it up like that. Okay, this one is done. Um, save that. I'll just save that project. Uh, next one, where was that? Sky replaced, okay. Um, next one. I don't know if this one needs any cleaning. No, that one's fine. <coughs> okay, so that one didn't need anything. I think this one might need. Yeah, there's a slight bit sky on this house here. Save that, close that one. Which one was it now? This one. Nothing there. Did I open this one? Here is some sky on here. And then this one. So this one has a bigger piece I noticed while it was busy. Uh, I'm just going to take the lesser tool here. Zoom in there. Okay, so I'm just going to use the lesser tool. 
and clean it up this way. I'm going to show you a, a different way after this. Maybe a quicker way. So like that and now I just need to touch up here in, in between the wood no never mind that I'm due I would rather just deselect this is confusing where do I want to deselect Okay, it's fine. Let me just do this. I'll only target the house. Let's just pretend the wood is not there. Because that looks confusing. First, I'll clean up the, the house. And then, now we can see. So, I'm going to select this then one by one. Or, you can take this other brush. That one there, and we can do this. So we can just click once here on the one side, and then I'll shift and then click all the way through. So that works. Hold shift, so that's just so that you can go in a straight line. So I'm gonna click the side, hold shift and go down this corner here I think that's it, just this part here oh, I think I missed this one Yeah, so that's how you can clean it up with um, with a brush. But let me just go back to the beginning here. I think maybe you can also do this. Use a cloud brush. <coughs> um, large thumbnails. And um, maybe this brush here. Make it bigger. So let me just first do this. Just clean up here. And then just use your cloud brush. So you can do this if you want to. And then it will just look like there's clouds there. So it's still masking it out with a black brush, but in the shape of a cloud, just to camouflage um, save that one close this one is fine let's check okay there I see on the house let's take a brush again soft brush clean that up save and one here. Okay, so there's also another big one. Uh, I'll choose a cloud brush. This way it won't matter that much if you go over. But if you use a soft brush, then you'll see that that doesn't look natural. not to make it too obvious <clears throat> and this one is also fine yeah so um, basically where is that folder my auto skies so it used only these skies 
in the auto in the batch sky so because I set this new folder as my for my paths and um, you can always just change the skies in here so you can then delete this put in some new skies that you like for a certain job and yeah and just keep doing that it doesn't really take long just set your new sky path with uh, in the settings I'll show you again settings uh, custom sky textures path and then click on browse path for you um, or you can have like a few folders then um, so you can maybe have folders in here uh, one you can just name it whatever you want and then I'll have them in there and then some other skies in there and some other skies in there so maybe twilight skies in the one bright sunny skies and then clear blue skies or whatever and then um, set your path for a folder depending what you're doing if you're doing twilights you choose this this folder there if you're doing another another job or whatever you choose one folder so you can just choose the folder according to what days you are you have uh, hope this helps. Cheers.